take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be doing something a little bit different. I am going to show you how you can clean your toilet using Tide. I know, like the laundry detergent Tide. I know. Seems weird to use it in the bathroom, especially to clean your toilet, but it is actually amazing at how well this works. And I definitely wanted to show this little tip and trick to you guys because I feel like it's game changing. So let's head into my bathroom and I'm gonna show you the state of my toilet. It is very gross, I'm gonna warn you now. I didn't clean it for like a week because I wanted to show you how good this trick really is. And we're gonna be cleaning the tank and the toilet bowl as well with this hack. So let's get into it. Okay you guys, so I am going to start by showing you what the toilet tank looks like and then we're gonna look at the bowl. It is really disgusting. <laughs> So, but I'm going to show you how to clean this. So, first of all, I know people don't typically think to clean in their toilet tank, but look at how gross it is in there. And you cannot tell me that there is not germs and smells that come from this. Absolutely there is. I mean, there's just no way. <laughs> So I'm going to show you how Tide plus a little bit of bleach can get this perfectly clean. It's really, really cool. And then I'm going to show you how to clean this toilet and especially, I hope you guys can see under here. Underneath. Yes, yeah, you guys can see just a little bit there. I can't get the camera too close. But underneath there, we're going to clean that as well, those little rings under there. First thing that we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and turn off the water. So just a little shut off valve there, so we're going to go ahead and turn that off. Just turn it all the way, and then we're just going to flush the toilet until the water drains out. So there is just a tiny little bit of water in there now. And you guys are gonna see how amazing this is. Okay, my bottle is leaking, but all I have in here is I have just cold water and then I have some regular old Tide, about a half a cup. Um, yeah, about a half a cup and just a splash of bleach. We're not trying to just like get rid of these stains by just bleaching them out. All I wanted was a little splash of bleach just in order for the disinfectant property. So and if you shake it up it's gonna do this <laughs> but we're just gonna go ahead and spray all over in this tank and we're gonna let this sit I don't know let it sit as long as you can if you want to do this at night time and let it sit overnight that probably would be best I didn't think of doing this last night so I'm just gonna let it sit for like an hour and then we'll come back to it. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and spray the inside of the bowl here as well. And then I'm going to do this little trick that I actually learned from a fellow YouTuber whose name is Andrea Jean. You guys may know her channel, Andrea Jean Cleaning. If you do not, I highly recommend you check her out. She does a ton of cleaning hacks and she also has clean with me videos. Um, but yeah, she uh, take, she does this with vinegar um, and she just will spray some paper towel or some toilet paper and tuck it up underneath the rim of your toilet and that allows some product to at least get underneath there and get on those stains because that's why those stains never end up getting cleaned because it's so hard to actually get product up underneath your toilet like that so if you tuck up some toilet paper with some product on it and let it sit for a while it'll actually have a chance to work on the stains underneath your toilet 
going to go ahead and I'm actually just going to dump the rest of this bottle in the tank. Um, my sprayer had stopped working. I need to get a new spray bottle. My sprayer had stopped working, so it wasn't spraying very well. So I'm just going to go ahead and just, um, just kind of try and put it all along the whole rim of the the tank. <laughs> what am I even saying? <laughs> I'm going to try and put it along the whole um, tank and just kind of like wash it up on the walls and that way it can get a good even coat there. Okay guys, so it's been, I don't know, close to an hour I think. So let's go ahead and scrub a little bit and see. Okay, so you can see how dirty this water down here has gotten. So I'm just going to go ahead and just do an easy scrub. I'm not pushing hard at all. It's coming off really easily. Oops. So you guys can kind of see how easily that's coming off. I am not scrubbing hard at all. It's coming off really easy. Also just cleaning my toilet brush right now. I just stuck it in here and I just poured some bleach in the bottom. And so that's just cleaning as well. Um, Okay, so now I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to remove the, um, I can't want to say paper towel <laughs> to remove the toilet paper from underneath the rim there. And you can see it's hard, it kind of was difficult to pick it up on camera. It didn't really, couldn't really see it too well, but you definitely can see that some of the stains have been removed. Um, there's definitely stuff on the towel for sure. And so now we're just going to go ahead and clean under there. Doing this, especially if you've never done it before because it's definitely a great way to get some product on there and actually start to remove some of those stains. I'm gonna give it a quick flush here. Remember to turn your water back on. Your tank will fill up. You can kinda wipe off all this residue here. guys can see how good this looks compared to before. It was really hard to get into some of these nooks and crannies, so not every little inch did get cleaned. It was very hard to get into all those little nooks. But look at how dirty that water is. How much dirt was in your toilet. Like how gross. And you always just think of this water as being clean, but certainly was not. Look at that. Gross. So we're going to flush this a couple of times. You can just see all the grime coming off. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh wow, I can build up the I know, it's pretty dirty, wasn't it? Okay, and then we're going to do it again. We're just going to flush this a few times until all this water comes clean. And this is going to help to keep your toilet deodorized and clean for much longer. Try to rub your camera in the toilet. <laughs> 
<laughs> I know that would be no good, would it? No way. Yeah, that would be no good if Mummy and, kept and off and the it, camera. And when the and when the when that robot when the and when you flash it, you wouldn't know how it came anymore. It would go down the drain of the toilet. Oh my gosh, I wouldn't have a camera anymore because it would go down the drain of the toilet? Yeah! Oh, that'd be no good. I better not drop it. <laughs> so as you guys can see, it is getting cleaner and cleaner. Like this water is just coming out. Probably one or two more flushes and we should be good. A three or four flushes. You think three or four? Yeah. But I can have yours on your camera. And look at... So a little bit of soap in there, but look at how much cleaner that is compared to what it was, you guys. Watch out for this. It's Still got a little bit of residue here. Yeah. Probably one more flush. We'll do it. All right, you guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I really hope that you found this little Tide hack useful. Let me know in the comments down below if you did, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't.